I'm a long-term friend of the Preservation Trust. And we're here today at Cascade Creek on Orcas Island. And this creek is actually one of the only creeks that has coastal cutthroat trout, but it also has Pacific salmon. No other creeks in San Juan County have that. So it's a very special stream. And what we need to do is to make sure that there's at least enough stream flow here for fish to survive. So I come out every month to make sure that we have enough water. Um, and I do that by getting total discharge readings. It's really very easy um, to get stream flow measurements. We just have something that will read the flow of the water in the creek. And so it also has a rod here that will tell you the depth. I can read the depth of the creek and then if I have the flow of it, um, I can actually get increments across the stream to get total discharge readings. It's important to get stream flow measurements because um, a lot of the streams out here that we have on the San Juan Islands, um, the flow can really get reduced in the summer. And so fish, that's the one thing fish definitely need is stream flow to have nice oxygenated water. And we just need to make sure that they are getting all that flow. I've seen salmon come up to this creek and build their little reds. They build out a little nest and they do it for a week and they sit here in the creek and they stay with their eggs. And to me, it's really important that we still have something wild left here, something that is wild for future generations. So if you love salmon as much as I do, you want to make sure that the creeks here stay cold, clear, and have bubbling water. You don't want to divert the water and you don't want to pollute the water.